<laughs> it is so fun here sometimes. <laughs> this is Freddie with LeviathanScuba.com. How did you feel the last time you wore a costume at a party? It was fun, right? What if you could dive a product that put the fun in functional? We'll get to that in just a minute. You know, I have been waiting to bring this video to you for a while because I'm so excited because this is a product that generates a lot of passion. A lot of people love this product and they always ask me, where can I find them? And so now they're on our website, leviathanscuba.com, which brings me to an interesting point. So these are the Fantasy Hoods by 5280 Scuba, right? This is in Cuba, diving one when I was doing the demo for them. But I have to honestly say, this is a product that we manufacture, and therefore it's kind of hard to rate something that you make. You're a little biased, right? We're gonna do our best to give you our best honest rating like we would rate any other product. But you know, you can help us. If you own one of these, maybe you can leave your rating down below for others to see. Okay, with that, now that you know, this is something we make. We'll get on with the review, starting with the cool factor. So you're on a dive boat, you're on vacation, beautiful sunshine, Caribbean or somewhere fun in the world, and out of your dive gear comes one of these fun hoods that you put on. Not only is it practical, right? It's gonna offer you protection and things, but all of a sudden, everybody on the dive boat, they're alive, they're gonna ask you a question. Where did you get that? That is so cool. And maybe if your dive buddy has one as well, you can show the theme or something fun like that. That's pretty darn cool, right? The fact that it, it starts conversation, makes people smile, it shows your personality and that scuba diving is fun. Our whale shark is our most popular design, right? Everybody's gonna be asking you where you got it. Be sure you tell them, leviathanscuba.com, right? So for the cool factor, we're gonna give this a rating of an 8.5. It's a good choice. Now features, they're pretty simple, but they are a little bit different than some of the other hoods you might be used to, the plain black round hoods. Uh, we have over 30 different designs for you to choose from, and they go from mild to wild. There's a dinosaur with scales down the back, a blue fin, a blue shark fin, right? We have those are a little bit more of a conservative design, but you have a shark fin in yellow and in blue. Simple, you have a bumblebee. That's a little bit more elaborate. You can get the pink bee, the yellow bee, okay? And you have uh, so many to choose from that it's really just gonna be according to the trip you're going on and how you feel about it or whatever demonstrates your personality from mild to wild, okay? They are made out of three mil, neoprene so they are stretchy they're thick enough to protect your head from bumps and scrapes and things in an overhead environment they do have an adjustable uh, velcro strap on two sides so one size fits all if i wanted to have it fit a little larger i could secure it down low on the on the the strap and it holds and then you have a locking strap that fits over the top of that if you wanted it to be a little tighter, you, you have four inches to play with. So that's how one size fits all. And then you have this lock strap that goes down so it's not coming off. Another feature they have that's very nice is at the top of them, they have small holes in them to vent the air bubbles out of them. This is the dolphin. Okay, so that's kind of, kind of fun. But you know, when you dive a hood, sometimes the air goes up inside and then you have this bubble or it lifts up off your head a little bit and they have these little tiny holes. So they, they thought about it and it's very comfortable to wear. It lets the air out, no problem. Then you have a hemmed area around the face and the neck. You can see it there on the pink bunny. The white part, that's a very soft piece of material that goes around the face and it goes around the neck so there's no chafing. Also, it finishes off the neoprene. There's no splitting, no cracking, no stretching right there. It's, it's very comfortable and it's very nice. This is actually the penguin, okay? 
So as far as the features go, that's about it. We're going to rate the features a 7.5. It's respectable. So how is it to actually use one of these, the function? Well, I will say they do fit well. I already showed you the adjustability, the four inch difference in the strap. So larger heads, smaller heads. Um, they do start out a little tight when they're brand new. The neoprene has to stretch and you can stretch the, the chin strap if you want to, to make it fit a little more loose. Um, and so they do start out a little tight, but they are more positive on your head than a do-rag or a buff because the do-rag just fits on the top, right? And sometimes when the air bubbles go up inside, it just lifts it off. And unless you snug them down, uh, which is my biggest drawback with some of the do-rags that are out there that are just a plain material, they come off the head pretty easy when the air gets underneath them. And then the buffs, the same kind of thing. When you fit them on like a beanie or like a do-rag style or something, they do come off pretty easily. Um, I don't really get cold that often in the types of diving that I do, so I don't wear one for the, the temperature protection, but I will say on longer dive trips, you know, a week long, you're diving three dives a day, your core temperature's going down, towards the end of the week, you're getting a little chilly and they can make a big difference on the head. What do you lose, like 20% of your body heat underwater through the head? So having a neoprene wetsuit on your head makes a difference. So a lot of people buy them for that reason. I buy mine usually for the protection that it offers me, as well as uh, one other feature that I didn't really think about until I started diving it, and that is sound. They do a great job of muffling the sound. When this comes over your ears, for me, you know from our past reviews that I dive with a special kind of earplug in my ears. This helps hold that right there so you'll never lose an earplug, but it also allows the bubbles to go on the outside of your ears instead of going across your ears, and you know that can be quite noisy. So this makes a huge difference on the sound, makes it quite a bit quieter under the water. And I too, when you get in cold water, I want to dive with a hood on, and these are just more fun, and they do provide the, the warmth. Uh, so it also, for ladies, they're always looking for something to keep their hair in place, right? This will keep the hair in place, whether you have long hair or shorter hair, and you don't want it all over the place, put one of these on, and you're demonstrating your fun side, but it's also practical, and it's keeping the hair kind of in place, right? So that works out really good. Now, they're really fun for couples. Uh, I, this is one of the most fun parts. There's an angel. So somebody's going to be an angel. Somebody can be the devil. You decide. <laughs> right? Somebody can be the shark. Somebody can be the dolphin. Somebody can be the fox. Right? Somebody can be the bunny. <laughs> okay? The penguin, the panda, the monkey. You, you decide who wants to be what. The, the pink bee or the yellow bee. Okay, so it's really fun for couples to, to wear them or dive buddies to, to have their theme going on. I'm a hammerhead, I'm a blue shark, you know, or I'm a whale shark and those kind of things. They're, they're fun. Um, I want you to know that we named them fantasy hoods because if you just Google or you just search for hood, it's going to come up with any kind of dive hood from a dry suit hood, ice diving hood, regular hood, you know. So... Fantasy hoods is what you want to look for. And honestly, you're only going to find these in a couple of places. Uh, one manufacturer makes some different designs, and then we manufacture these, and any of these designs you see here are exclusive to us under our brand 5280 Scuba. I'll tell you what else is kind of fun, too. We have uh, people, we have this senior ladies group that they go on a dive trip every year. And they call us up and they're like, okay, what do you have this year for us? And all the ladies wear a different hood or they'll pick a theme and they'll go on this dive trip. And they're all senior ladies. So they're down in the Caribbean and they're diving on their, their vacation for a week. And every single one of them wears a hood. So that's a lot of fun, too. We, we get pictures back from them and that's, that's a good one. Um, some of the designs are a little more simple, as you've seen, and some are a little more intricate. More moving parts, more pieces, more, more patterns. So a, a nudibranch or a hammerhead shark, those are going to be a little more elaborate. A blue shark, you know, just a little bit more. So you decide, based on your personality, which is best for you, right? A little more mild, a little more wild. 
And so they function well, they're fun to use, they cause people to smile. We're gonna give them a rating of a 7.5. Okay, next on the onto the quality. So pretty simple, three mil neoprene. Uh, they're all lock stitched. We do have that nice hem that kind of keeps the neoprene protected on the cut edge. Um, they are coated or they, the neoprene has fabric on both sides, so it's very comfortable. No raw rubber against your skin or anything like that. The parts that are attached that are longer like the monkey tail or the tiger tail or some of the parts like the dragon, the, well, the dragon's tail, and then the yellow shark, you know. We have our ogre over here. Some of those parts and pieces, they're really locked down nice. They're sewn on well. And uh, so for the quality rating, we're gonna give them a 7.5. As far as durability goes, we have never, since we started having these made for us uh, three and a half years ago, we have never had one come back to us for a quality issue, not one. And so that's an easy thing to say right up front. Maybe longer term will tell. I will say that I wore the spider web design on about 20 different trips over about three and a half years. This was on a shark uh, research trip with fins attached. And this gentleman was an underwater photographer, photojournalist, and he so loved the spiderweb design that I gave it to him. The color is still nice and red. The stitching is fine. That hood right there had been on 20 trips, approximately 350 dives on it, and it was still in great shape. The Velcro was a little fuzzy, but I could still tighten it nice. It did fade a little bit and it loosened a little bit, but we could adjust it with the four inches of uh, the strap. And so they last, a, they last a long time. So for durability, we're gonna give them, based on a three and a half year rating, uh, of a seven. So let's talk a little bit about value. You know, these are not gonna be as affordable as just a simple black hood, just a plain old black neoprene hood. There's quite a bit more that goes into the manufacturer as you can understand, right? So they're not exactly cheap to produce. This right here is a clownfish, one of our more popular designs, very popular. There's one of our instructors. He uses it uh, on the Cozumel trip for the last three years in a row and everybody that he's leading in his group, they can easily find him and know. And that's three years old, that's footage from this year. So there's only two places to get fantasy hoods out there, and one of them is $20 per hood more money. So I think that helps on the value side of things. That leviathanscuba.com is a little bit less, and you can only find these designs with us, okay? So it's definitely commitment, but they last a while. They do provide a practical use from protection and warmth and things like that, and also on the fun side of things, right? For value, we're gonna rate these a six, right? They are a little more expensive than some other gear than you can put in your dive bag, but we think they're worth it. So the pros are that they do offer you warmth. They do offer you protection. They're definitely fun. They're a conversation starter. And you know what? Perhaps more important, they make people smile. They enjoy them. The cons are they are a little bit more expensive. They're kind of tight when they're brand new. Um, the brighter colors will fade over time. Three and a half years so far, the red one definitely faded. The other ones that we've used really haven't faded much at all, but they will. So for the overall BA rating, we're gonna give it a 7.3, respectable. And remember, we make this thing, we're biased. So we love them. They're a lot of fun to, to, to use on a dive trip. If you have one, why don't you give the people an idea of how you would rate it, okay? Now in summary, they're not for everybody. Some people's personalities aren't gonna be comfortable wearing a monkey on your head <laughs> or a shark or a panda on your head. But some people are. And when you, when you enjoy that with other people, then that becomes a lot of fun. Where can you find them? LeviathanScuba.com. Have fun. Go check out all the designs. Take care. You know why we do this? We do this to help you. And if this has helped in some way, would you consider helping us? And give us a like below. And if you know somebody 
who might benefit from these videos, please share it with them. And if you haven't already, hit the subscribe button. That way you'll know when the next one comes out. Make it a great day.